Look how late in the evening it is. It is almost 7 o'clock, but it's still blood daylight. Oh my god! <laughs> Hello everybody, this is Beano4657, and today is now... Oh yeah, it's, it's August 10th. August 10th is today's date. And if that date sounds familiar to you, it is the last day that Borders is having their um, special out of, uh, going out of business sale. So I am going to go over to the store and see what they have. I don't really plan on buying anything as of right now, but I just feel like going to check out, see what, uh, see their selection of books. Usually I just go over there for manga though. So, let's head into the car. There's my car by the way. I know I've I I shown this car before. My car before. It's my car, not your car. Shut up. Let me get my keys. Okay. Borders isn't too far from here. Hang on a second. I usually start my car with my left hand, I mean my right hand. So. Oh, grab the seatbelt. Get reach back there when I'm holding my camera. Uh, sorry about the, my, all my jiggling around. Oh man, it's hot in here. Turn on the AC, man. C A C P. It even says A C. You might have noticed that my radio is missing. That's because it's been missing for a long time now. Yeah. After I've been living in this town for about um, not even a year, my car was actually br broken into. The window was shattered, and my radio got stolen, and that sucked. But I mean, I didn't really listen to the radio that much anyway. I can always get a new one. My nose, my windshield looks kind of dirty. It's because I have not had a, I have not gone through the car wash in a long, long time. Hang on a second, let me get my sunglasses. It's pretty bright out here. And I don't want to be driving in the sun, man. So we need to head to, oh, shit. Okay. So we need to head to, not, we don't, we're not going to shit, okay? We're going to 72nd Street, which is down this way. Oh, do, do, do. It's a red light. Okay, so, okay, so what have I been doing these days? Well, I've actually been pretty busy with work. Um, I was working all afternoon yesterday, and then uh, last night I decided to stream my practice run of Beautiful Joe. So, I don't know, like, when, um, like for some reason whenever I upload a stream video, I maybe get like 30 views on it, but then only maybe like 14 people actually show up for the stream. So, it just makes me wonder that people just don't want to come, or whatever but that I mean that's not really important now I don't really care how many viewers I get as long as people are enjoying it we got another red light this is 96th Street by the way I pass by this corner a lot I mean this intersection because it's got like everything there's a, the high V's around here and there's lots of gas stations here too high V dust and yes that is actually a real place Go. One thing I noticed in this town is that they actually have timers on the red lights. Like, not for the street lights, but for the pedestrian lights, you know, the ones that tell you to walk and don't walk. They actually have timers on that now. And I'm, a I'm actually really glad about that because I've seen that, um, oops, shit, <laughs> my camera. Um, cause I've actually seen that other, uh, that, um, Japan has actually had, um, pedestrian lights like that for a long time now, and I'm wondering, when are we gonna get that? Well, we did. We finally got it. It does, I mean, it, I heard in Japan, it actually beeps. Like, you'll actually hear beeping, so, so you actually have a warning, but in this, but in this, but in our, um, ones just, like, count down from 10, it'll go like, like, you know, 10, 9, 8, 7, blah, blah, blah. Oh, that was the Oh crap, I forgot. You can't actually get to 78th Street, so um, 72nd Street from here. Oh wait, no, we gotta take Giles Road. Crap, I hate taking Giles Road. I mean, I don't necessarily hate it, it's a nice place and all. Wait, what is he doing? Oh my God, what the frick are you doing, man? Signal, signal, they're there for a reason. 
I was actually supposed to take another turn. But, uh, I was actually supposed to take that um, turn on that corner so I can get on L Street and then I can drive all the way to 72nd Street. I screwed up. I'm sorry about that, everybody. So it's going to take me a little bit longer to get there than it's supposed to. I think I'm, I think I'm on a phone call. God. I need to put the camera down for a second. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, anyway, here's Giles Road. Okay. What's going on in this town? Whoa. Sounds like something's going down. I don't like this. I don't like it when stuff happens in this town. It makes me nervous. Oh well. To be honest, I don't even really like this place. I mean, I guess it's kind of nice once you get used to it, but there are so many things, and uh, yeah, like you know, if you analyze a place too closely, it's gonna look like shit. Uh, anyway, oh my god, change, 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 it's still red, still red, oh my god. We got a green arrow, let's go! Well, I'm moving, 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 in my convenient cup. I'm a moving, 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 moving. I think I need a donut. Alright, now while I'm not entirely sure, but I think 72nd Street is up ahead. And then we need to turn left on it. I'm taking a really roundabout way of getting to borders right now, and it kind of sucks. Oh my god! Another red light! Oi! Son of a bitch. Oh, it's like, let me get this in my other hand so I can actually signal. Right there. Yes. Okay. So, we are getting closer. I can see the road up ahead. And we are almost there. Okay, so. I don't know what else there is to talk about. I guess I should probably just cut it off until I actually get to the store, just to save on, on my camera's memory. And to keep this video short, it's probably already like 12 minutes long or something, I don't know. I'm a moving, 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 moving. In my convenient cup? Why do I keep saying that? I don't need to keep quoting Ernest. I kind of love Ernest. I wish he was still around. Uh, what do we have here? I need to turn the AC down. Which is done with my other hand, which is usually done with my right hand. We have here 72nd Street, so we need to turn left here. This might actually, there's actually a chance that this might actually give away my location. So people might know where I live now. Ah, man, that sun is way too bright. Stupid sun. Who does he think he is? Where does he get off? There's another emergency vehicle up ahead. What is going on in this town? He's on the other side. It looks like an ambulance, actually. Oh, man. Something is happening in this town, and I don't like it. That's the third emergency vehicle I've seen today. Actually, now that I'm getting closer to it, it looks like a fire engine. But it turned off its siren. Yep, Ralston Fire. Maybe the emergency just got over. Huh, there's an LMS. 
elementary school here. I hardly ever go down this road, so I wouldn't know that. Elementary schools have open houses? I thought only... Really? They have open houses? Well, I guess when you're graduating elementary school, but I didn't think it was as important as graduating high school, so... Hmm, go figure. The more you know, man, the more you know. We're actually really far from where we're supposed to be getting, where we're supposed to get to. If I would have gone on L Street, this would have gone on much faster. I'm gonna have to take this slow road. Oh my God, people, the drivers in the city are so freaking nuts. They're always trying to get the get the places as fast as possible. But I mean, that's kind of natural when you think about it. But it's just that, I mean, you shouldn't go too fast, obviously. That causes, that's like, you know, against the law and it causes to stop for the other, for other drivers. This road is so crowded for some reason. I didn't think 72nd Street was a really popular road. And the light just turned yellow. Good thing I just got past it. The guy behind me went through it. Huh, who does he think he is? <laughs> oh. Okay, it looks like it's going to be a while before I get there, so I'm just going to stop the video right here. And I'll start up again when I get to Borders. So I'll see you all. So I'll be right back, everybody. Look at that. 25% off. Original price. Look what I found. <laughs> what was the original price of this? $11. So what's 25% of $11? Um, some decimal number. Let's see, 25%. Okay, so let's see. That's 10 divided by 4, then. So that means it's going to be like $3 off. I don't really have anything else here that I want. I was actually thinking about reading this one, but they don't have the first volume of it. Hmm. Yeah, I remember seeing the anime adaption of that, and it was pretty good. Yeah, they got like nothing here. Oh, look at this. Hmm. Hmm, okay. Higarashi. Not really interested, really. I mean, it was a good anime, but. This side doesn't really have very much. What is this? I've never heard of this one before. Looks like the looks like the cover to K-On. Um, I wonder if they have K-On here. That'd be awesome. They actually got StarCraft. Only it's front. Only it's like left and right. It's like an American book. Interesting. They got Street Fighter too. Doesn't this seriously look like the cover to K O N? I swear to God. <laughs> if they have the first volume K O N here, I could show it to you. Where would it be? Be over here somewhere. Uh, no, it'd be on the other side. I didn't see any K O N on the other side, so I'm guessing they they don't have it in stock right now. Hmm. This is... Nope. Yep, yeah, here's Lucky Star Volume 6 and 7. I guess I probably could get both, but... Hmm. Nah. I only came here pretty much to buy one book. I shouldn't buy any extras. Look at these huge Chobitz books. Man, look how huge this is. I 
one if it's like the whole story. Exactly like the other one. What's the original price of these? Nothing dollars. Hold on a second, I need to put the camera away. Okay, well here I am outside the store now, and this was the book I ended up getting. I got Life Star Volume 6. It was really the best thing I saw there. They didn't have Chibi Vampire Volume 1, and I decided against getting k and this game, I mean, and this book, because that'll, that'll put the price up to like uh, $16. And I didn't really want to spend that much on just books, so... Um, there was actually another store I wanted to go to. You see that all across the street? Hang on a second, I'll zoom in for you guys. Oops, have my finger covering the lens again. Let's see if I, I'm not covering the speaker, am I? Okay. You see that right there? It says Noodles Company. Sorry about all the loud noises, but that's uh, the price you pay for living in a big city. So, um, I will just unlock my door. The reason why I wanted to go to the newest company is because they have a lot of Asian style food there. So I wanted to go see if I can pick something up there. But other than that, there really wasn't anything I wanted to do today. I mean, out, I mean, like, you know, out on the town. Though I hardly ever go this way. I don't particularly like this place, but I don't know. I just hate downtownish areas. Like, you know, lots of traffic and Got lots of weirdos running around. I'm like the last time I was here, I, I'm I'm not kidding. The last time I was here was around um, July 4th, and there was a hobo. It was right. It was like a little bit before July 4th, and there was a hobo, and he was begging, he was begging for money so he could travel somewhere. I'm not sure what you'd call him. Uh, I'm not sure if you call him a hobo. I think he was more a drifter, but I mean, yeah, I, I just saw one. I mean, I, yeah, I saw one the last time I was here. You know what? I'm gonna go check out the noodle company because I still got some time. I promised a friend I would be home soon so we can play League of Legends. Yeah, I still play League of Legends occasionally, so if you're ever, if, if, if any of my fans out there play that game, then you can probably play, uh, play with me. I mean, I'm not really all that good though. I mean, I'm level 30, but I still, I'm still just not good. Because <laughs> I played like one ranked game and then I completely sucked. And everyone was yelling at me, so I'm just like, okay, well, I'm done with this. <laughs> anyway, I just need to turn here and get to um, the Noodle Company. Because the Noodle Company has everything you need for noodles. I don't know. I, I don't even think that's their slogan. I don't even know if they have a slogan. I just made that up. I make shit up. Come on. Change green arrow, green arrow. I need a green arrow. Give me some green. I am just trying to amuse myself by singing because there's nothing else to do in the car. Change, 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 change. Come on. How long is that red arrow gonna last? Come on. Come on! Oh. My. Thank you! <laughs> For some reason the other day I was reminded of a jingle. Do you guys remember the old Tootsie Roll commercials where that old, where that jingle would, uh, would happen at the end? Where, 
or some kid would just sing everything looks like a tootsie roll to me or something like that i don't know if you guys even remember that my, I'm like I'm like in my 20s now, so I just remembered all this. I just sometimes just remember all this old, old stuff from a long time ago. It looks like a restaurant, actually. I thought it was like a store. I hope it's not a restaurant. There's a GameStop right next to it. Well, uh, might as well go check it out, I guess. Looking, 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 everywhere, but not there. You guys can actually name the show that's from, then you guys, I'll, s I don't know what I can give you, really. How about just, if you guys actually know what I was quoting, then... You're just amazing. You're just ama you're just an amazing person for knowing where that's from. Why is the GameStop next to a Chipotle? Whatever. I'm not here to ask questions. Looks like a restaurant. Yeah, it's a restaurant, so I'll just go into GameStop instead. The Wii's off. It sucks. Ooh, look at all these DS games. Hmm, let's see what they have here. Do they have Castlevania? Castlevania? Do they have Castlevania? They don't. Oh, look, a 3DS. Oh, this is the new Dead or Alive game. I wonder if 3D can actually show up on the camera. Kind of. Just barely. I'm not good at fighting games, though. Ooh, look at this. It's Natco's version of the new gold controllers that came with the new 007 game. Ah, GameCube. Custom Robo, hey. <laughs> oh man, look at all these games. Hmm. Do they have Metal Gear? Metal Gear! They don't have Metal Gear. Metal Gear! I wish I had some Metal Gear! Super Monkey Ball Adventure. What's this? Huh. Looks pretty good. I don't really have them. I don't really want to spend money on any games. I'm really just browsing. Look at this. Look at all these copies of Wii Fits. Look at that. PlayStation 3, huh? If only I owned a PlayStation. Hey, look at this. Final Fantasy 4 PSP Edition. The complete collection. What's complete about it? Oh, Final Fantasy 4. In Final Fantasy 4, the after years. Sorry, it's a little blurry. Fantasy Star Portable. Now I heard lots of good things about the Fantasy Star Portable games, but I can never play it since I never own a PSP. What is this? Oh, that's nice. The sticker's over and I can't even read the title. Fan... Fans... Might be Fantasy or Fantasia or something like that. Let's see... Dragon Ball Z Burst Limit, that game is terrible. Ooh, look at this. Twenty dollars for pre-owned. Comes with Bass Fishing, Sonic Adventure, Space Channel 5, and Crazy Taxi. 
Duke Nukem Forever. No thanks. Dynasty Warriors 7. Dynasty Warriors Gundam. <laughs> they made the Dynasty Warriors Gundam. Hey, Castlevania. Looks like the new Lego Star Wars game. This is the biggest collection of Wii games I've ever seen in my life. Metal Gear Solid 3. Too bad for PlayStation 2, which I don't have. Shadow of the Colossus. I heard lots of great things about this game. Lost the PlayStation 2, can't play it. Devil May Cry 3. I never played any of the Devil May Cry games. And I don't think I ever will. I mean, they're all for systems I don't have. Playstations, or maybe the original Xbox, or something like that. They have a Mortal Kombat for Wii. I prefer Street Fighter. Ooh. I heard this game was pretty good. The Nintendo, and that's one of the Nintendo Selects. Not bad. Not bad at all. All these Nintendo Selects games are now $20. Stuff like, um, well, that game, for example. They also have the, the Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess on Nintendo Selects. Ooh, Rayman Raving Rabbids. I rented this game. I mean, I rented one of the games. I think it was Raving Rabbids 2 for Wii. And that game was really, really fun. Uh, Wii Play Motion. Oh, look at that, inside. But it's just a generic game case, so you know it won't have it. What's down here? <sighs> Sometimes they have pretty good games down here. Ooh! Four classic Mario adventures. All redone on Wii. Huh. Ooh. Tales of Symphonia, Dawn of the New World. I heard this one was worse, though. So I haven't really been interested in it. Sonic and the Secret Rings, that game is awesome. Sonic Rise Zero Gravity, that game's alright. Sonic Unleashed, that game's awesome. Really? Blank starting hurt. All these Nintendo 3DS games. I would actually pretty much like to get um, the new Ocarina of Time 3D. The thing over there. Look at this. Pac-Man and Galaxy Adventures. I gotta tell you, this game looks freaking sweet. Like, I know it's just another remake of Ocarina of Time, but, I mean, just the looks of it is just freaking mind-blowing. New releases? You see Mario Brothers isn't a new release. They're lying. Mario Kart DS isn't a new release either. And neither is this. This was the first game for DS ever released. That was years ago. Harvest Moon DS. I've never really been into Harvest Moon aside from, well, when it comes to portables. Oh. I can smell the noodles from that uh, restaurant next door. <laughs> okay, well, I guess I'll turn off the video right now, so I'll see you all later for more stuff. Yeah. This town is actually kind of cool, but I don't know. I just don't like crowded cities, places. They just don't really do it for me. I prefer nice, quiet towns, but hey, what can you do? Day in the life, everybody, a day in the life. The wind messed up my hair. If you could actually see that in the reflection, that'd be really embarrassing. Okay, so now that I'm in my car, it's nice and quiet. I can't turn the key with my with my left hand for some reason. So yes. I'll see you guys all later for more stuff. Or something like that. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, here well here I am back home and I know I said I'd
go away, but sorry, I'm back. Anyway, um, I got the manga out of its plastic wrap, and I was just reading the back here, and it says, Effects of Lucky Star 6. When you read those that happens all the time stories, do you get a happy feeling? These, there, these are an abundance of just that kind of unfocused four panel manga storytelling, and those stories you don't don't in the and those stories you don't get will help you out too maybe especially recommended for those researching moe <laughs> uh whoever came up with lucky star is a freaking genius look at this especially recommended for people who never find those rare items people who seem to make dogs bark for some reason people of those who are self-conscious about their bus size <laughs> oh my god okay let's read this back here let's see what does it say ah this manga's latest volume came out but there are times that I forget what happened when a lot of time passes between volumes. Oh, that's true, huh? What does this small text say? Um, you have no idea until you reread the series. Also, there are times when you forget how many volumes you've bought already. Or when you wanted to buy each volume, but you somehow missed, uh, missed the volume in there. That happens too, huh? I've never had that happen to me. Then there are even times when you forget to buy a manga that will be eventually pulled from the shelves, like like weeklies or monthly anthologies. And the worst manga and the worst are the manga that take forever to come out. I think if I ever become a pro manga artist, I'm going to have to be careful of that. Wait, you're not you're not looking like that was a joke. Ah, <laughs> uh, you guys are weird. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, that's, that's some funny stuff, I tell you. I'm just going to put it here with the rest of my volumes. I have three on top, because that's the one I'm reading currently right now. And then here's one. Sorry, it's hard to see here. Let me turn on this light. Oh, that's right, unplugged this one. Oh, wait, no, it didn't. Okay. And here's two, so I better put these in order. So one, two, and there's three. So I'll just keep that one on top. Here's four. And there's five, which I haven't even read yet. So I'll put I'll put these two on top of six right here. And then we'll just slide that back over there. I need to like get a separate shelf for my manga because it's starting to get a little bit too big. So there's one and two. And there's three. I'm gonna get back to reading three later today. Cause I still need uh, cause like I actually got four and five for Christmas uh last um, last Christmas as a present from some members of my family and I haven't gotten around to reading them yet so I need to do that so yes here's me again okay bye everybody sorry that took sorry I took sorry about that I actually hit the record button again so yeah okay now this is the final goodbye okay yes I'm sorry I took so long looking around at GameStop I'm just fascinated by looking at the kind of games people are making these days so I'll see you all later for more Custom Robo and Tales of Asperia coming soon. So I'll see you all then, everybody. Bye.